Khan appeared to return to Benin late Thursday following two days of angry post-election violence in which at least two people died, as the definitive results of the parliamentary polls were published. Turnout was 27.1%. The president of Benin's constitutional court, Joseph Jogbenu, announced higher than the 23% previously when preliminary results were released. Considering the irregularities and the disturbances, during the vote, these are still not of a nature to compromise the validity and transparency of the vote, said Jog Benu, who is close to President Patrice Talon. Violence broke out on Wednesday shortly after the provisional results were announced of Sunday's vote which had been held without a single opposition candidate. Two former heads of state, Boney Yei, who was president from 2006 until 2016, and Nice F4 Soglo, who held office between 1991 and 1996, had urged talent to annul the vote which they described as an electoral state coup. Earlier, soldiers had fired shots as they clamped down on the second day of angry demonstrations. Large numbers of troops and riot police, as well as hundreds of protesters manning burning barricades, squared off in the streets of Benin's economic capital Cotonou. A witness said three people were killed Thursday as soldiers opened fire, and a video seen by AFP showed troops shooting as protesters fled. The police and soldiers. They started firing, they chased people, said a resident. We heard shots, lots of shots. A woman died on Thursday after being wounded the day before, medical sources said, and a man was brought to hospital with a gun.